it's Roberta Perry of Scrubs Buddy Skin Care, ScrubsBuddy.com, Scrubs Buddy across all socials except for Instagram, which is Scrubs Buddy Products. The five things that I wish someone told me when I launched my business. Niche your niche. Ah, I wish I had not subscribed to the everyone has skin, so everyone needs my scrub mentality. Finding my niche of customers and then sharpening that list even further was what helped me define my business and help it grow. Unfortunately, it took me a couple of years to figure that one out. Number two, buy what you really need, not what you think you may need, within reason, of course, due to recent and hopefully ending supply issues. But don't overpurchase if you can help it. This will keep cost in reality check as you're trying to keep them under control. Number three, have a plan for consistent marketing and stick to it, even if it is as simple as sending out a weekly email. Your customer base wants to hear from you as long as you're giving them information that resounds to them and offers advice on solving their problems. Number four, get a mentor and or a mastermind type group. People who share your love of business help lift you up, they encourage your ideas, they let you bounce the good ideas, they tell you when ideas are bad, and you do the same for them. It's really, really beautiful. And finally, number five, don't be afraid to pivot and shift your business plan. Write it in pencil so you can be constantly tweaking it. Notice what's working, enhance it, notice what's not working, and change it or stop it. It's that easy. Even if you have spent money on the project, continually throwing more money onto something and time on something that's not serving your company's greater good, it's just not worth spending that extra time and money on. So cut it out. So thank you for listening. Roberta Perry, scrubsbody.com.